we might have inadvertently created the greatest reason for Christian strife in a long, long while with the creation of the Holy Roman Empire. Oh, God. Everyone is joining the defensive pact against us. Okay. Unlikely that we're going to go to war anymore. Except for... Fighting some... Oh, no. Sometimes it happens if you alt-tab out of the game. That you can't click anything anymore. Now you gotta alt-tab back in. Alright, uh, so what we want... Is we'll raise some troops here put ourselves in charge and only ourselves and fight raiders left and right here's they're running away Yeah, let's have some serious risks. Great Lord, I seek power. And we get the blessing of Azael. Azazel. Plus three martial for us. Why do we keep getting better? Uh, okay, would like me to sacrifice a virgin. No, thank you. Unlikely I will be able to find one. Keep an eye on our succession there. child cannot be bought and this woman does not wish to be bought so let's begin taking her out of the running and smear our adversary we're going to spy on him and spread rumors about him <coughs> or maybe this way we'll get to take care of these issues. Yes, burn the apostate. Always burn the apostate. How many people have we killed so far? 47. That's a decent kill count. Let's see. We're not going to lay low ourselves this time. Maybe they find us and burn us at the stake. That would be okay. Can we get higher centralization still? Legalism needs to be higher. Where are we on legalism? Still far out. He has an imaginary friend called Bapo. Sure. Do that. There we go. General opinion of his goes down. It didn't help. Just need to die quick so we have a chance here to rule long again and change some rules and everything. 
What do we need? We need culture points. Who does culture things? Cultural tech. Uh, have him sit here and do cultural tech. And we ourselves are going to swap our focus to scholarship. Build the observatory. And maybe we get some culture points still. Speaking of which, where is legalism highest beside ourselves? Ah, over there. Looky there. So let's have him get us some technology. He might just die, but... They're just chances we need to take. I hope I just... I need to die before all these favors run out I bought. It's really all I need to do. Should be so hard. Do we have rivals that we can duel? No. We could antagonize him so he becomes our rival. And then we can duel him. I suppose. What are you plotting? Ah, uh, keep the claim thing going, that's fine. Does anyone want to kill me, maybe? That does not look like it. And you definitely stop this. Oh no, that's the target. Constantly sending his troops down here somewhere raiding our coastline Now you need to do cultural tech you can't look for an artifact someone else could yes very good give us cultural technology points totally worth it need a bunch could build a pyramid for our dog but we don't fear revolts at home so shall have a funeral and that's that so most of our health modifiers should be gone hope more people of our order are being found out and killed Plots, plots, plots. People are trying to kill my wife. Which we don't care all that much about. Ah, yeah. 
Riding over the hills, I see a group of haphazard soldiers coming for my unit, weapons raised. When they are finished with us, all my men are dead. I sink to my knees in the dirt, wondering why am I still here. Uh, you will struggle in the future to overcome these events. Nah. Let's get him. I'll kill him myself. I lose the duel, and I'm now severely injured. Well, I did have a little chance of dying there. Didn't take. Severely injured. These don't really take away from our health, sadly. Let's figure out how the stars move. Can his advantage? Sure. I think this is grammatically a little bit wrong. Did he surveyed his borders recently? That's double past tense. Did he survey his borders recently? Has he surveyed his borders recently? Let's send a falsified report to him. I don't know what's going to happen. So we'll find out. We'll find out in a moment. Ah, oh, he's indignant. Found out about my... Lies. I swear, if he gives these titles away, I'm going to be so upset. I'll have a private conversation with her. Maybe we can seduce them all. I will try and seduce her. Life is good. Another lover added to the pile. Want to invite her or domenically possess her? Bit of a shame. Let's tainted touch her. So that she might die. More raiders for us to fight. It's time to do the devil's work. The father of the family died last, but ah, but the marvels he got to see first. Satani carved the wife's face off and pranced around wearing it as a mask, taunting and kissing the man while I boiled baby fat to make a flying potion. Finally, we constructed an idol of Belial from the dismembered bodies. Yeah, let's let's leave it. It will please the devil more, and we get a five-year plus twenty percent national tax modifier. And we have made a friend. Ain't that beautiful? Predictably, the populace of Linen didn't appreciate the glorious monument of tortured flesh that we left for them to find. In fact, they were so riled up that they have taken up arms against their rightful rulers. Playtime is over. Alright, we gained some military checkpoints. Not sure how many troops are waiting for us here. A bunch. I think we should get our holding troops involved here. While I do relish the chance of getting into duels, I'd rather not lose. Ah! 
Perfect. There we go. There we go. We have a new air. The defensive pact is gone. Honor the dead. The great emperor Erekan of the Holy Roman Empire is dead. Maybe he's in heaven in the company of the saints and God. Or maybe in hell in the company of Satan. But here on this land I must decide how to honor him. His body may be put to rest in the Desmaheim mausoleum. Well... Let's commit him to the earth in a ceremony that shall be remembered. Emperor Erekan has given up his ghost at age 66. He did succumb... He died succumbing severe injuries. A pious man, he spent many years and resources trying to spread the word of God among the heathens. That he did indeed. So who we have now? Emperor Mel Colium, surrounded by enemies and rivals. We hope that Mel Colium's rule is not struck short by the means of a dagger to the back. Long live Emperor Mel Colium. That's that's a very beautiful image up there. Right, so we got all our holdings back. Actually, we got... What? Oh, we got most of our holdings back. But that's okay. I can live with a little loss. We have a few more than we would like to have. Crown focus in Dijon. Oh, no. We'll put our crown focus down here. And... We will keep Dijon. I believe. What duchies do we have? Let's check our duchies first. Oh, that's a county title. Duchy of Mumu, yeah, that's ours. Okay, we only have the Duchy of Burgundy and the Duchy of Mumu. And so it shall be. What duchy is this? Duchy of Abruzzo? Kingdom, and this is the Duchy of Provence. Okay, let's create that. And grant it to our dear son. Shall have County of, not Dijon, no, 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 Provence. And he shall have the Duchy of Provence as well. So now, once we are done with our little war here. Oh, we have more troops again. Lovely. More retinue, which we don't want. Okay, let's get people up in here. A loyalist. That is most certainly welcome. Court tutor. Our dear wife, who is pregnant and a genius. That's good. Let's name a successor, a successor. And it shall be our son who shall be our successor. I've recently inherited an item from Edekan, the Emperor Edekan. It has probably seen better days. Oh yeah, we'll take care of it. Why is there already a defensive pact against me? It was a memorable funeral and procession, procession full of honors for Emperor Erekan of the Holy Empire. The Holy Roman Empire. God, what I'm reading today. His body now rests in peace in the Desmondhine Mausoleum. Everybody will remember how I honored him. Ooh, ooh. Those who hated him might not be pleased. Okay. All right. Our dear wife should rest. And we'll stand down our troops here. Save for our retinue. Good. Let's win this war. And we need to 
Organize the coronation ceremony now. And of course, only the Pope is fit to crown me. Doesn't like us all that much. Well, we can improve his opinion of us for a little bit of money. Let's do that. Stop our weird plot here. We don't want that. Return to stopping all plots automatically. Because I can't be bothered with this. Check out the people who are in line of succession. And my candidate doesn't have much going for him right now. He is only a child. After all. <laughs> our nephew, our former nephew, is a, is a bit of an oddball. I feel a bit of an oddball. Okay, we're depressed. So now we could commit suicide, which is nice. Uh, Valdesian. Yeah, let's renounce the secret faith. We'll leave some prestige on the table. Well, that's okay. We don't want to have some secret religion on our head. Ooh. We have two great bloodlines in us now. A lot of Sorcha the Great. Anum of Thrace, we get damage plus ten percent. Vassal opinion plus five. Characters tend to become ambitious. Uh huh. Interesting. Very cool. So our son should be of these. No. Ah yes, we're leaving the society. My wife feels better. We could join the assassins. Let us join the assassins. I don't think I have done that so far. So, the Holy Roman Empire is secure in our bloodline for the moment. I say that knowing full well that it might not last us very long. But we'll see how long indeed.